highlighting real heroes who uplift their community. T.J. Holmes is about to give one deserving man the surprise of a lifetime. We often say that, but we really mean that. Yeah. A million times we mean that today. How's it going, T.J.? You know what, Robin? I'm tired of all this whispering and sneaking around. So can we please just let the cat out of the bag here and let my man know what's going on? Because we've been talking about him forever. And there he is. Wesley. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt, but it's for a good reason. I'm T.J. Holmes. Good to meet you, and I've been downstairs. I know you know something's going on, but I'm here with my new buddy, my new buddy, Nevea, and my other new buddy, Dawn, <laughs> a.k.a. your mother and your daughter. Now, you all go ahead and get over there. Now, I know you think you're here doing something with the local news today, uh, promoting your nonprofit, right? Your nonprofit is called what? The Save of Bernard Rivers. Okay. That's true, but not really what's been going on this morning. See, I'm T.J. Holmes with Good Morning America, the show on which you are live right now. And I have been talking about you with my friends, Robin, George, and Strahan, and the whole country all morning live. I know you knew something was going on down there. I've been sneaking and buzzing and whispering all morning to finally get to this moment to say hello to you. Doing all right this morning, brother? I'm doing amazing. You're doing amazing. Well, we want everybody to know how amazing you are. So we are going to share your story with the country now. Just one minute cardio, let's get it. Wesley Hamilton is a father, an entrepreneur, and an active advocate for paraplegics in his community. He makes you feel like anything is possible when he comes into the room. He's just the type of person that you want to be around all the time. But his story is one of pain, personal growth, and reckoning. He was very into the streets. He just was not the person you see today. In 2012, Wesley was shot twice in the abdomen. His life forever changed. And they like, um, can you feel this? Wesley said, no, I can't feel it. Man. I mean, to see your child lay there and you can't do anything for him, it was really rough. Not only that you're dealing with the mental part from your injury and the loss of your legs, you're dealing with what caused that as well. He thought about suicide, but then he also thought about this child that he had, that he had to be there for her. And I'm so thankful that he didn't do anything because I would have been no good, not at all. Wesley made a change for his mom and for his daughter. My dad's a superhero to me because he, um, he helps me out, he motivates me. My dad is literally the most amazing person I know. In 2015, he founded the nonprofit Disabled But Not Really. Through community programs and mentorships, the organization works to instill a limitless mindset in those living with a disability. Y'all ready for this workout? Turning gyms, a space not often geared towards people with a disability, into a place of possibility. Push through, Dave, push through. The energy that he brings to the class and whatnot is, is unmatched. I mean, it's actually a place where I feel like I belong. It is amazing to have Wesley here and to watch him do what he does with his disabled athletes. Wesley has come a long way and touched a lot of lives on his journey. Just to see, you know, the little teddy bear you, to see you now helping people the way you do. I'm so proud of you. Thank you so much for being a part of my life. Just wish you success and love. Wesley, Wesley, Wesley. How do you react to seeing your story and how people around you react to how you've uh, touched their lives? Man, it's, it's, um, it's amazing. I wasn't expecting that, but uh, just I'm grateful to know that I took control of my life and it began to inspire others. I uh, paved the way just to give other people the opportunity. And Mama Dawn, I have you to bring you in here, but you're, we, we see this big smile. He has a huge, infectious smile. Look at that face. But those were some dark, dark times. What is it like for you to see now that transition from when he was shot? It was, it was almost 10 years ago now, mm -hmm. from those dark times to this guy. It's an amazing transformation. 
and I'm glad that he made it. Um, and I'm glad he's changing lives. Mm -hmm. Including for that one standing right next to you. Yeah, including <laughs> this one. <laughs> uh, now, I know you're running the, the, uh, this nonprofit. You've had it going since 2015, I do believe. Everybody knows a nonprofit costs money. Yeah. Uh, so <laughs> we heard about your story, wanted to share it, but also the folks at the, Greg, uh, the Craig H. Nielsen Foundation. They are dedicated to helping people with spinal cord injuries, with, for research for people with spinal cord injuries. They heard about it and they wanted to make a <laughs> donation, but they're going to let you choose what you get. Now, you're going to decide by spinning this wheel, and whatever you land on, <laughs> they are going to donate that amount of money. So no pressure, <laughs> but give it a good one, man. Good one. Anything from 10 to 100,000. So go ahead, Wesley. Get yes. Give it a good spin. Oh. Give it a good spin. Come on now. Come on now. Come on. Give it a good one. Give it a good spin. Give it a good spin. What we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? Uh, okay. 40,000 is good. Now tell me, what can that money, $40,000, what, what are you going to be able to do with your nonprofit with that money? Oh man, we just we just launched a mobile gym and our goal is to take what we've been doing and spread it across the country. Um, and one of our biggest things was just finding a vehicle to transport. And this is gonna give us the opportunity. To buy that vehicle. Give us yeah. 40, see one spin and you got a got a vehicle, just like that. Well, all right. Well Wesley, I Actually, the folks at the Greg H. Nielsen Foundation actually told me I was authorized that no matter what you landed on, that I can actually go ahead and put it to 100000 yes. <laughs> So you're going to get $100,000. Um, actually, the folks at the Craig H. Nielsen Foundation said, TJ, you can use the wheel as a ruse if you want to, because the real donation we want to give him is a million dollars. Wesley, it's not a joke. This is for real. Oh my God, Wesley. Um, they heard about you and they've been following you and they love your story and what you've done. This is real for you to continue your work. Can I get yes. words from you right now? <laughs> oh my God. I just thank you. Um, thank you everybody for just being believing and watching the journey. Um, it's always been about the the people that we've been serving. I'm, I'm just grateful, of course. I don't have a lot of words right now. This doesn't seem real. Uh, if you know my story, you know where I come from. It doesn't seem real, but it gives my people hope, and that's all I wanted. Wesley, I want you, as we go back to our studio, I want you to put into words, you got shot and you ended up paralyzed, and you said that actually saved your life. <laughs> Yeah, the man that tried to take my life gave me life. And this is me every day, and I've been living. Um, I'm living my purpose. And everybody's seeing it. You know, follow your dreams despite the circumstances that happen to you. And this is what it is. Wesley, brother, you are an inspiration. All right. Mama Dawn, Vea, you as well. Um, and Craig H. Nielsen Foundation for the work they do and what they are giving you for the work you are doing and being recognized for it. So, uh, Robin, George, Stray, this is, I told you this would be one like we've never quite had before. Um, so, uh, we're kind of out of words, and you know, I'm usually not at a loss, uh, but I will just hand it back to you guys now. Wow. Thank you so much, TJ. I mean, that's not... Wow. When you get to see someone's life change, and how he talked about how he thought something so tragic was going to change it for the worse, and how he made it, he made his message message. Yeah. He, he really did. He summed it up so beautifully, then tried to yeah. take his life, gave, gave him, his him life. life. I'll and never forget that. What? And the way that he's going to impact has and will continue to impact so many other